Welcome to Peaceful Streaming. Um, so I'm back in my New York, historic New York apartment. Um, the one I started last time or started two, two streams ago and then I did the kitchen in the last stream. So I'm going to do the, I'm going to try to do two streams today. Um, the only problem is I did my shot for my MS um, last night for the first time in weeks and so I'm, I've got a whopping headache for one thing, but I'm going to try to. Um, so I'm going to do the bathroom in the bedroom. Uh, not sure if the bedroom will take very long. Um, but since I have to be a little more creative <clears throat> because of the tight space, who knows? It could be a, even more, it could be more complicated than if I had the space to put a ton of furniture in. Still not sure what I'm going to do with this. And I'm wondering now... I have all that room. I think maybe I should, maybe what I should do <clears throat> is make the bathroom bigger. I kind of assumed I would need that space, but I, I don't really know what I can do with it. So, so I think I'm going to do that. Because um, bathrooms are difficult already so this this apartment I'm kind of doing like like I think I had mentioned I'm not doing any ultra modern decor in any of these because it would look kind of strange for one thing um, but um, this one in particular and I think one other I'm doing them a little more, a little older. I don't know if it's just me, but the music seems awfully loud. Yeah, it is loud. Why, why do I have it up that loud? That's weird. Um, so, uh, so yeah, I mean, I did this, uh, you know, I, I kind of wanted it to go with the arch and the marble and all that. And I, I just didn't want to do... Um, so, so that's why I did, um, well, I'm having one of those days. Um, so that's why I did, um, the, the kitchen with that, that furniture, if you want to call it that, the counters are called count and they're from the, um, the castle. I'm trying to figure out whether it makes sense to put this in the middle. Well, maybe I won't paint it till I'm sure I'm doing. Um, so, you know, so that maybe some places would have like the original um, cupboards, some of the apartments and others wouldn't, but none of them are gonna be ultra modern. I just don't think that makes sense. Um, I wonder if I can fit the toilet there. Wow, yeah, this is tight. Okay, so for now, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna decorate it and I'm gonna, not gonna worry about exactly where the wall is gonna be. So. You know, this is weird. There's this light leak, but there's no lighting in this room, right? I mean, there's one mini halogen. There's some kind of weird things going on. Oh, this is the original floor, which we actually apparently don't have, which is kind of strange. Um, so that's, I don't understand that light leak, but you know, bugs. So with that huge window, I mean, well, okay. The size of the bathroom, we obviously cannot fit a bathtub in. I mean, maybe we could, but it would be a really small bathtub. So I think I'm gonna do a shower. It's obviously not gonna be huge. And, oh, wait a minute. I'm gonna turn on the lights. That would be helpful. Um, let's see. 
light switches. Okay. Um, uh, there's not a ton of light in here. Uh, let's see. I'll just put a temporary one up. These aren't, aren't really pretty, but they do throw a nice, even light. Nice, even white light. Okay, so I'm not sure if it really makes any difference which side I do it on. So I'm going to put the, the hardware either there or there. I'm going to put a glass, a small glass, um thing um and then on the same side as the shower i think it usually makes sense well i could put the i could end up putting the toilet anywhere put the sink over here toilet here so we'll just we'll see how it shakes out so i was looking at the tiling and um i haven't really used the new tiles much because i don't know i don't think they're that great looking except for some of them like the Rosanto white is nice the rest of them not so great um I'd really love to do like what I think the original bathroom would look like th that kind of tile but I have to say a lot of those are not terribly attractive so I'm going to look and see if I see anything that, hmm. Uh, so I, I like some of these tiles. The problem is that they don't have floor tiles to match them. Um, these aren't bad, but I don't know. I don't think they're great either. So, hmm, yeah, no, this is not, I've, I've used that before. It's not great. Um, this always looks like kitchen to me. Is that just me? Let's see how this looks. I'll give this a shot. I think that there's, let's see if there's floor, um, let's see if there's floor tiles or not. Um, you'll see me doing this with my hands because of the heat, a lot of different reasons I've got nerve pain. So um, it's not a twitch or anything. It's just trying to get rid of some of the pain. Um, so the problem is this is a small bathroom. I wonder, I, I, don't, I wonder if I, what about the pink stuff? Now these are all kind of boring, these mosaic ones. I've tried them before and though they're kind of, they're right for what I'm talking about, they just end up look, looking kind of boring. Oh, do we not have, oh, there it is. Okay, so let's actually try putting it on the floor and see, it's kind of nice. If I wasn't trying to do, um, it looks nice on the floor. Why does it look? so much darker on the wall than it does on the floor. It's a little weird. I mean, that's a whole nother shade. Are there more than, are there more than one? What is this called? Yeah, my, oh, yeah, 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 okay. Um, this is called <laughs> decorative light porcelain tiles. Thanks guys, that's very descriptive. I don't think they're, I, I think it's just that those two don't actually match. That's what it looks like. Decorative light. Yeah. I mean, this may, this may be why I never use this. Shoot. I actually liked that for the floor, but, um, I mean, I could, let's see if I could find something that coordinates with it. I don't think it's going to be easy, but it's like gray, a tiny bit of blue. Um, I 
so weird. I mean, I could probably find paint that would go with this. I could use the... I definitely could think of one I could probably use. Um, but I think the, the walls would be kind of boring. Let's see what we have. I don't think there's any wallpaper that would go with the, the floor tiles, right? Wait a minute. Um, so what if we have, we don't, so we don't have any light, white low panels with wallpaper. Why? Shoot. Um, that's too bad. I was hoping maybe we could find something that coordinates. Um, okay, so I know, where's the blue? So the one I was thinking of was Fresh Morning. What if this looks, I mean, let's just try this out. Maybe this, maybe this will look good with us. Little too blue. I don't think we have. No, we have gray. Gray's not my favorite color. It generally is. Seems a little depressing to me. We do not have red paint, green paint, orange paint, blue paint. Oh, wow. I'm wondering if I should, oh, nah. I'm wondering if I should just, I'll look at the rest of the wall tiles, but I'm wondering if, now I wonder if this, and that's very blue. Rats. What if, um, so we have some gray ones here, the Rosanto, it's very dark gray. And I know I rejected the, matching tiles because they are gray but the problem is it's like they're supposed to match but they don't and that bothers me more than anything um nope oh, not blue uh I mean, the pink does look kind of attractive in a way, but it, it's much more 70s, I think, 60s or 70s than, um, than the era I was hoping to, to go for. Um, I thought I knew what I wanted to do here. What I was also thinking is doing the blue on one wall now before i even looked at the floor the blue on like one wall and white on the other walls so um let's try let's try that it's not my favorite color but <laughs> now i don't think i don't think we won't be able to use that floor but i can use either the blue or the white God, these are huge. Okay, so that's, let's just go with it. Let's see what. Okay, let's sell these. Okay, so let's look at putting, yeah, let's do the white. Rosanto square white close no cigar okay um i mean i don't know if this is gonna work but i feel like um a lot of the time doing a white an all white or this isn't strictly speaking white but um anyway let's just say it's white um bathroom is can be pretty boring um it's 
finally sunny. Right when the right when the fog's coming in. Um Okay. I think I probably could literally finish this with one more set of tiles. I'm not gonna right now I'm not gonna do the inside of the window just because I want to get an idea. Now, I forget who it was who told me. I think May. Hey, Barry. I'm actually not doing great because I did my shot for my MS. And when it's been this as long as it's been, like literally weeks, then the side effects are pretty bad. But, um, but other than that, uh, that's just temporary. So uh, I'm okay. How are you doing? I don't know about the blue. Well, I think part of the problem is the tile on the floor. At least I hope that's part of the problem. So, okay, let's do Los Santo. Um, let's put down the white and see, or the cream. I just, I don't know. The blue is such a strange color. I think that's part of the problem. Um, I don't think the green's gonna be any better, but let's give it a shot. I honestly thought I knew what I wanted to do with this, but I guess I was, I was like way too optimistic. I don't think the green's any better. Well, let's do the whole thing. Um, I just don't wanna do like another white one or another gray one. I'd love to do the pink one, but it doesn't really go with this whole idea. I don't think the green's gonna do it. No. Even less so than the blue. Um, why anything in particular or just the the you know the, the same thing that you've been dealing with try this Let's try just doing this just at the end. I can tell I'm not really. So worst comes to worst, I will just do the entire thing in this white slash cream Rosanto thing. This this style of, of doesn't really go, does it? Well, let's put the white back on that wall to my right. Okay. Yeah. Well, hang in there. Um, I have to tell you that, um, so my son had been kind of status quo with his depression for a long time. And then, so his doctor about um, five, six weeks ago, maybe two months ago, um, augmented his, the Wellbutrin with, um, now I remember, I forget which it, exactly which one it is, and it's kind of not important because um, everyone's different. Um, I forget what I forget what it is, and um, it it took a while, but all of a sudden he says he feels like he he feels a lot better. So I honestly haven't had um, much luck myself with augmenting mine with something else. But that doesn't mean that, obviously, this shows, and thankfully, that, that that's just going to be everyone's experience. Um, I'm very iffy about this. So the, the thing is, is just, to, um, is just to remember that even though it's really hard to keep trying, 
it's definitely worth it. I think that would give me an idea. I'm not, I don't know, I'm not grabbed by it. I think I might do just that in blue, that wall in blue. And I think, I'm not liking this. Let's do that wall in blue. If I end up really hating it, I'll just make it white again, but I'm gonna give it a shot. Um, definitely like to give it a shot to do something different. But I mean, the thing is you're dealing with a huge amount of stress. I mean, it's not necessarily negative stress, but stress is definitely um, the enemy when it comes to depression, mental health in general, anxiety, depression, so. So once you get more into your comfort zone at school, then hopefully it should get better. I'm gonna have to get another one of these, really? Oh, it's the window, because it takes so many to do the window. Okay, so... So let's see, it might actually be tough to match the sink. I may have to do, I wanted to do maybe that teardrop sink. Um, okay, so let's sell that. And I will put the tile out here. Um, yeah, I think the sink is, is something I'm gonna have to figure out like now. So I'm gonna look at the ones from Workshop first. These all say Everly Black Sink. But I think they're different colors, aren't they? Yeah, that's pink. But that's not work. I don't think with the workshops, any of the workshop stuff you need. Oh, I just can't put it flat against it. But so if that says black, then so this one is probably white. It's too white. Yeah. Yeah, I had a feeling this might be tricky. Um, can't be a huge sink. Corner sink's kind of eh. But now the teardrop one, there's a good chance I can't put anything on that. And I think it's too white. Well, I think it's, I don't know, actually. I think it might be too big for this bathroom for one thing, unfortunately. Okay, so I think I'm gonna go with a pretty basic one. Um, it's it's been getting there. Um, I mean, this whole thing at work has kind of, you know, um, torpedoed my recovery to some extent, but. Um, I'm doing a lot better than I was a few months ago. Let's put it that way. So, excuse me. So I can't complain. Definitely, I'm definitely improved. Um, okay. So, shoot, I guess it's still 80 degrees outside. It's really nasty. It wasn't supposed to be. So this looks actually, hmm. Actually, this one might be good. Um, no. So I'd probably have to do some kind of lighter wood. Or, no. What about gray wood? Is that what I had before? Yeah, it was. It's too dark, I think. Well, maybe not. Um. I don't think we have a blue that's going to match this.
Yeah, we have blue, but... Um, where's the bat? Okay, here we go. That's not bad, actually. Um... Because I won't be able to... The only thing I'll be able to do in blue is the... is the sink. So... Yeah, let's try that. I mean, I'm not... It's, it's not that I love it. But... I don't love it. Shoot. I do like the sink. Um, is there anything that's less white? Pure white. Definitely not less white. Um, can't do white. So I'm going to do the wood one. And just find a nice... Um, midway wood that's not too dark not too light not too warm not too cool Ugh. well i actually do want to add a little bit of warmth so that would be good okay so i think that's what i'm going to do for the sink um so I need to put the installations in. So let's do the shower. I get to, I'm having trouble seeing this. I think that should be good. Okay, so, um, bathroom fixtures, baths and showers, um, so let's do the old-fashioned one. Let's do light. That's too light. Let's do dark. Um... That's big enough. So uh, remember, Barry, um, you should definitely think about getting in touch with the um, counseling center or whatever it's called when they're open tomorrow. Why does that thing look? That's weird. Oh, is that because you, so you also could put a tub under it? It is, isn't it? God, I, I'm a little slow. Um, let's see. Excuse me for yawning. I'm not sure what's going on. I got an okay amount of sleep. Freestanding walls. And, but this is going to have to be pretty narrow. Like this one. Um, it is dark. How's this? That's plenty big for a shower in this small apartment. It might even be... I'm going to move this over a little. Okay. So then I'm going to scoot this over just a little bit. Um, and assemble it. Actually, I thought, why does that look so wide? It's not, but I guess it looks wide in this bathroom. That's the problem. And just let me, I just want to drink a little of my limeade. Um, okay, so I think the sink is the next thing to put in.
So I think I'm going to center it. Okay, so I think I was going to go with spruce, right? So I want, uh, not dark gray, dark. No, that's really dark. Okay, so I'm going to use light on this. Yeah, it's still pretty dark. Um, the tabletop, pure white. I think. Mm. I'm going to keep it simple. Okay, so I'm just going to go with, I'm going to go with white. It's kind of, eh, let's do pure white. And then um, handles light. Oh, no wonder. I was like, why is this already um, getting washed out? That's why. You might also want to see, Barry, if they have like a peer counseling group on campus where students counsel other students. Because then you might talk to someone who's who's basically gone through the exact same thing and can tell you how they dealt with stuff. Um, I know you have that that like autism group or whatever, but um, peer counseling could kind of more gen gen generally handle other stuff. Um. I do not know what to do for the ceiling. I could warm, I mean, I could really warm up the place by using these lights. Because it's gonna do pink and yellow. But I don't think that's what I want. Plus that hangs really low. Um. Yes, I just hate the yellow bulbs in this thing. This elven ceiling lamp. The bulbs are just so yellow. Yeah. Yep. I did um, four days last week. You know, Monday was a holiday, and I'll do five days this week. So, um, it is what it is. But, um, not for long, I don't think. I mean, I don't know how long it'll take to get another job, but pretty dedicated to it. I applied to um, six, seven jobs. So um, yeah, I I want out. Um, wow, that still is really washed out. I mean, I could try a different, um, different thing on top, but I mean, is this just too bright? I think it's good for that area. And now it's not totally washed out. Okay. It's not the most exciting sink, I have to say, but, um, so this, I think calls for well, that might be too dark. That's too light. Light might be too light. I, you know, that sink just looks. I'm just not sure that sink works. Um, what else do we have? Not a lot. Um, you know, I never looked at the kitchen ones. Of course, they have that that whole. Oh, now wait a minute. Hmm. I think that would be better. This Manalo or whatever. Hopefully, there's a. Does that look too modern? The beach. So that's the same color. But it just doesn't look very elegant, does it? Um, gray oak, white wood. That looks pretty white. 
So if I did, I wonder if I could find a tabletop that coordinates, because this has more tabletop, like this one. This is more tabletop options. I just can't tell exactly, or maybe like, let's see, light gray. No, gray wouldn't work. Beige. Nope, too beige. But there's like a light, uh, see that's too dark. Gray marble. Mm. Brown, granite, too dark. Shiny gray. Cream, white marble, black marble, uh, white matte. So I think, um, I, hmm. I wonder if I wonder if this one has a gray wood, gray the gray oak. If I did like, um, nope. I'm gonna move this out of the way because some of these are have things that are too high. What about that? I mean, maybe it's just me, but I think that looks pretty decent. It's not, it's not very fancy though. Oh, that actually looks nice. I guess the problem was the wood. Um, brown oak, American oak. What was the one that I really liked? Mahogany, not coarse dark oak, natural oak. No, wait a minute, the darker one, brown oak. Brown oak, mahogany. Okay, so then, I think I like it. So then what would we put? Sink, white, faucet, light steel. So what would we put on the top part? Um, so yeah, um, and then tomorrow I have my re performance review which for the first time in 15 years that I've been on campus, I'm actually apprehensive about. So, and I have to say, I also, after having two bosses who said to me, you know what, as long as the work gets done, I'm not gonna worry about when you clock in or out. Um, then this is not really enjoyable. Let's just put it that way. And I have to like say mother may I all the time. And I also thought of something else that made no sense. So my boss had been saying that, you know, I knew all along I was supposed to be in Monday through Friday that I didn't have um, any, any high, you know, my, my job wasn't hybrid at all. And then something hit me and I was like, wait, then why did you ask me if I had what I needed in the beginning, he asked me if I had what I needed to work from home. And if not, he'd order me stuff. And so I said, I have a monitor and, um, I have a monitor and desk chair. And so what they do a lot of time is they just, they buy it like one department and, you know, basically buys it from the other. And that's what we did. So I'm like, I was thinking last night or this morning, like, wait a minute. So if I'm not supposed to be doing work from home and I was supposed to know that from the beginning, what, why, then why that? How does that make sense? So it's like, there's so many things that don't make sense and are complete and other BS. And so, but my husband's like, just let it go um, and move on. And he's right. So I'm just going to, um, I'm just going to forget it. And the only thing is that if there's anything, if there's anything negative that I don't agree with in my performance review, that's not going to happen. I will just refuse to sign it. So I guess we'll see. 
not big on confrontation, but okay, so that's way too big. But um, I'm, I'm also not going to let an unfair... I mean, I have a perfect, perfect performance view, a performance review record on campus. 100%. I'm not letting this job I've been in for five months and hope to leave soon um, screw that up. It's just not going to happen. So, oh, that one's even bigger. Okay. I would like to use wood. This one kind I don't think it's going to have the wood I want. Chocolate larch. Um, is this going to be too dark? Burn beach. A little bit. That's huge too. Oh my God. I keep forgetting. This is a tiny bathroom. Um, okay. So let's see if there's anything from the workshop. Ooh, that's so cool. Isn't it? I wonder if I'll even be able to fit. Oh, is that like kind of destroyed? It's cool, but I guess that would be save it for my haunted house. Uh, uh thing. I I'll do a haunted house one in, um, in October and so that would be good for that but okay that's too big oh my god this is what have I done in the past with these small bathrooms here's this but I th think ooh well it's pretty cool I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna do it yeah let's do it Okay, so rug. Let's see. Um, this is going to be hard. I don't know what's going to be in here. Ooh, that's nice. I thought it's going to fit. But it doesn't really it doesn't really have the right colors in it. No. I need a small rug, don't I? I suppose I could go with one of those like rag rugs. On the other hand, wait, I think I know. Wait a minute. Okay. So this one, no, that those colors are going to be wrong. Large fringe rug pan. I don't think this is going to be right. It's not bad, but um, but I think now I try not to use this one too much, but I really like it. So that's and it does go with a lot of different things, a lot of different, um, you know, like co um, color combinations. Where is it? It's like mixed in with, ooh. Uh, it's not, this is, but I like that, but it's not gonna go with the one I was gonna put down. Um, I could, um, okay. I could do like a cream one here. That is so cool, I really like that one. Hang on, let me see. Or I could do blue. Um, I wish this one came, it, you know, if this one came in small, that would be really nice. But it doesn't. I mean, obviously I won't use the daisy one. That's too bad. Um, I wish she would, she would do it in small. Okay, let's see. So the one I was thinking of, I think was this one. But I couldn't have both of these. So let's see if I can do, let's see if there's a blue rag rug. I don't know what, the, I don't know what they're calling them, the person who did them. They're um, rug braided. Uh, this one's too dark, rug braided blue. um lilac okay so i'm just gonna look um quickly at the workshop 
not a lot of rug braided. Um, let's see. Aqua. I have blue. I don't. I'm not seeing a light blue. That's too bad. Um. Now there is gold that would match. I have gray. Let's see if the gray is maybe a gray blue. Um. I, well, the gold's not going to match that. Such an awesome rug. Um. I don't know if it's downloaded. No, it didn't. So the gold, I mean, but it's just not the color I would pick other than for the rug. So that's a problem. I'm going to screw this up just for that rug. I can, I can tell. Um, cream, I could do cream. Uh, let's see the, let's see how the blue looks. You know... Let's try that, but let's let's try the cream. I should probably just put in braided. I don't think there's a lot that's braided. Cream, and then there was the gray. I don't think the gray is going to work. No, let's try the cream. That's too light. What about, there's like a tan, isn't there? Peach, beige. Um, I think the blue works better. So let's put the blue in there. Oh my God, where am I gonna put the toilet? I forgot the toilet. Okay, so first I have to put in the toilet. Oh. Um. Well, I always knew this was going to be tight. Um, so I think what I'm going to do is move the sink over and then put the toilet in between the sink and the shower. Um, let's see. Sink. Yeah, so let's put that there. Unscrew it. Um, God, now I have to remember what sink it was. Okay, now I remember. Um, okay, so it was the mahogany? Close enough, I think. Um, and then the light, I believe. Yeah. White and then light steel. Okay. I hope that was the right um, counter. Okay. Let's move this over and well okay kind of hard to get it close but not too close okay there um okay so then the toilet can go right about here um i mean it's definitely gonna be tight but it is what it is this, I don't understand why that happened. That's very strange. Um, okay. I mean... You know, I could, if I move the doorway over, I could put it here. That might be, I think that might be better. Because otherwise it's just this here so it doesn't get knocked down. I don't know why I'm doing that. I don't need to do that, do I? Um, I didn't need
need to knock all of those down. Okay, so put that there, and then that, and then this is gonna be a full column. Hopefully, oh gosh, is, is this like gonna be really hard to get by the sink? Well, now I can move the sink over. Jeez. Um, well, that's what happens. Okay. That's what happens with these small bathrooms. It's just really, really tricky. Um, I guess I lost on my phone. I lost connection for a little bit. But, um... Just on my phone. Okay, so let's put you here. Move you back here. And put the sink back for the third time. Okay, so it was mahogany, um, light. I think that's just nondescript enough. Um, light steel. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so, yeah, it's going to be tight, but it's not like I didn't know that going in. Okay, um, I was looking through, I saw this, um, I think Board Panda, is it like 40 or 50 construction fails. Maybe it was 30. It was a fair amount. They were very funny. And when the house was literally built upside down, I don't think it was necessarily built upside down. I think it was maybe like a tornado or something moved it, but so it was kind of funny. Okay, so let's put that there. Okay, so I'm gonna put the toilet back, I mean the rug back, right there. Well, this could be tricky. Move this over a little. Come on, it may not work. Oh my gosh, seriously. The toilet's too big. Is that it? It's a big toilet. I just want it because it looked a little uh, old fashioned. Well, maybe this is actually the right size. I'm beginning to think it is. So yeah, we're good. Um, okay, so then let's see, how many do I have here? Three, I need more, right? Well, I guess not. Okay. I need to put mini halogen covers on, um, like chrome or whatever it is. Yeah. Um, now, we do have curtains now that do work narrow short we don't have a lot of selection um let's see so if i did uh i don't know it's white with with like blue edging 
Mm. I get the feeling the blue is going to be like really blue. I think I'm going to do um, a shade here for the bathroom. I think that's fine. There's just not enough room, I don't think, to do a um, like a full size set of curtains. Um, I'm just going to go with white. Or not. Is this in the way? Oh, wait a minute. No, I have done them with the, this window, right? Mm, I don't know, actually. I can't put shades up. Well, I guess that takes care of that. Really? I really, I can't put this up here. Are you kidding me? Um, okay, so we need hand towel. Well, we need towels, period. Um, so let's just keep it simple. Toilet paper dispenser. Okay, and then we need, so we need a drain. Workshop stuff, they have it under drain and grate. That's a little dark. Um, he's been doing well. Um, he's off to a concert. Um, but he seems to... He was saying yesterday that he didn't think he was a lot better. But my husband and I had noticed that he did seem to be better. And then this morning he said, you know what? Actually, I feel like I am doing better. So sometimes, sometimes someone who is outside the person it notices that they're doing better before they do um that happens a lot so um so yeah he um i mean fingers crossed but he does seem to be doing better so um we'll just see that's a little big um yeah, so, I don't know, like I said, fingers crossed, um, I, but I think that, um, I think this, this medicine that's augmenting his Wellbutrin might possibly be the answer, so that definitely would be great. Because, um, he actually was doing, so... Before, like, before the pandemic, he was doing really well. So he decided to take himself off the antidepressants to see if we, he still needed them. Um, after like three months, he realized he still needed them. He went back on them and then the pandemic hit. And that, the pandemic really, like, and not being at school with his friends and stuff like that really affected him. So... Um, I guess I'm 
to go to gallery. So yeah, he um, he hasn't been doing well for a while, but he seems to be doing better now. So I'm very cautiously optimistic. Um, so we'll see. Oh, here are my screenshots. I'm hoping there's something here. You know what? Actually, this one I think will do nicely. I don't know what size. I think that size is mm, too big. I need to move the screenshots again out of out of the gallery folder because it takes forever. Um. Okay, so let's make this like seventy. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's good. Oh shoot. Oh, it fell down. Yeah, this is a problem. So this problem is back. That's just wonderful. Um, that's just great. So the second time you do it, it's fine. Like for some reason. Oh man. And then of course it's hard to grab it. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> this is this is usually not this hard to grab. Um, shoot. Okay, I'm going to put the painting on again, and then offline I'll just fight with that. Because that could take me like 10 minutes, seriously. Which I don't want to do. Okay, so let's try this again. Yeah, that's why I said like the second time it's fine. So um, I'm going to move this back a little. I will get this out at my break. At least I hope I will. Okay. Um, so I'm gonna put the bathroom accessories on. But thank you for asking, Barry. Um, uh, we definitely have reason to hope, so. Fingers crossed. Okay, so let's do, let's do this. Um, my color light. And then, um, let's see, this is Manta. This, this one doesn't have a cup, I think, if I remember. Yeah. And toothpaste. <sighs> That's weird. Our, my Wi-Fi must be going on and off. Um, okay, so toothpaste. What else do we need? Besides a plant and besides getting that out of there. I think, um, yeah, I think actually a plant would be good here. I'm just gonna type in plant because I actually downloaded. It may they may not be wall plants, but I did download. Um, this might. Oh, that is really nice. The person did a wonderful job. Okay, so that I guess is supposed to go on the floor. So I'll probably use it, but just not there. Um. I think I'm, mean, you know what I haven't used in a while is those little wall plants that are like bright green, small leaves. Since I haven't used them in a while, I think I'll go for them. Uh, small. And there we go. So, should I do the light blue? Sure. Um, I, I feel like I'm missing something on the wall there. That pink, man, I have to get that, I have to get that away. 
Um, okay, let's see. Shower. No, shampoo. Uh, yeah, let's do this one. I like these. And light gardenia. Let's see. And conditioner. And then, um, so I think we, I think it's SYB. I mean, we've got these tiny little ones there, but. Um, there, let's do this one. Okay. I wonder, I think I can probably fit another hand towel over there. Let's do that. And then I think I'm probably done other than putting a door on there. Obviously. Um, oh, cloth, wrong one. Okay. Let's get this a little over. Um, so if we can, that is probably a little big. I might, I might offline make that smaller. Actually, I probably will. But, um, and other than getting that thing away um i mean it's not my favorite bathroom ever but it's turned out better than i thought it would and um i love this daisy mat so um yeah and then i'll put a door on too obviously so i'm gonna take a break um barry you're probably going to bed right um i'm gonna take a break and then um I'm gonna fix this stuff and then I'm gonna do I mean the bedroom's not gonna take long <laughs> let's face it um so I'll probably do the bedroom and I might be able to do the living room because there's not a lot I can fit in although a lot of times the challenge of it is what is what um you oh you will great um the challenge of it is what takes the time so that might be the case this time and uh I'll also paint also repaint it so anyway so i'll be back in like 20 minutes maybe something like that um tops and oh my gosh and uh yeah so barry um uh hopefully i will see you but either way thank you so much for stopping by and everyone else who did too i really really appreciate it uh, of course everyone watching the vod i really appreciate you guys too um even though I can't interact with you one-on-one, -on -one, it's still wonderful to see the comments and all that stuff. It's all that stuff. And just that you you guys are enjoying it. So it really makes it fun for me because if not, I definitely would not would not have played this game like a thousand or eleven 1 hundred hours, however long it's been, um, if I couldn't show it to people. So yeah, this makes it fun. So um, take care of yourselves and I will see you soon.